The Qing Dynasty, also known as the Manchu Dynasty, was the last imperial dynasty in China. It ruled from 1644 to 1912, but by the end of the 19th century, the dynasty was in decline. The reasons for the fall of the Qing Dynasty were many, ranging from internal conflicts and corruption to foreign aggression and economic instability. In this article, we will explore the events and factors that led to the fall of the Qing Dynasty from 1895 to 1918. One of the main causes of the fall of the Qing Dynasty was internal conflict and corruption. In the late 19th century, the dynasty was beset by factionalism, with various officials and warlords vying for power and influence. Corruption was rampant, with officials using their positions for personal gain and enriching themselves at the expense of the people. This led to widespread discontent among the population, who saw the government as ineffective and corrupt. Foreign aggression was another major factor in the fall of the Qing dynasty. In 1895, China was defeated by Japan in the First Sino-Japanese War which forced China to cede Taiwan, the Pescadores Islands, and the Liaodong Peninsula to Japan. This defeat was a blow to the prestige of the Qing Dynasty and signaled to the world that China was weak and vulnerable. Economic instability also contributed to the fall of the Qing Dynasty. In the late 19th century, China was struggling to keep up with the economic and technological advancements of the West. The government was unable to modernize the economy and implement effective reforms, which led to a decline in living standards for many Chinese people. The Boxer Rebellion of 1900 was another significant event that contributed to the fall of the Qing Dynasty. The Boxers were a group of Chinese nationalists who rebelled against foreign influence in China. The rebellion was fueled by anti-foreign sentiment and a desire to restore China to its former glory. The Qing Dynasty initially supported the Boxers, but they were eventually defeated by a coalition of foreign powers, which further weakened the dynasty's authority. In 1911, a revolution broke out in China, led by Sun Yat-sen and the Chinese Nationalist Party. The revolutionaries called for the overthrow of the Qing Dynasty and the establishment of a democratic republic. The revolution was successful, and in 1912, the last emperor of the Qing Dynasty abdicated, marking the end of more than 2,000 years of imperial rule in China. In conclusion, the fall of the Qing Dynasty was caused by a combination of internal conflicts, foreign aggression, economic instability and popular discontent. The dynasty was unable to adapt to the changing world and failed to address the needs and desires of its people. The fall of the Qing dynasty marked a turning point in Chinese history, paving the way for the establishment of a modern, democratic China.